Hello everyone, welcome to my channel ESP.NET Core and today I am going to show you uh, doctor appointment booking system in ESP.NET Core and in which you can see that here we have a admin login, patient login and the doctor login. So when we click on any button, uh, you, uh, you will interface with the uh, credentials like uh, login and you know that that feature will be used uh, in the identity server. So a application user have also a admin uh, patient and the doctor. So uh, only application user <coughs> check the facility that like a admin and the patient and the doctors like that. Okay, so uh, that panel is used for the admin as, as well as well as the uh, doctor as well as the patient. Now suppose you are a uh, suppose you you are a customer and you want to book uh, book appointment uh, of the doctor. So that uh, navigation bar will show uh, the options uh, to show uh, for the users. So, so here we have a my details, book appointment, view bookings, cancel bookings, search doctor, feedback, logout features. Okay, in the new booking system, you will see that appointment ID that is automatically generated in uh, ASP.NET Core and the category, which type of category you can you choose in that uh, um, field like that. Uh, um, you can see that uh, disease category and the doctor which types of doctor you want like uh, orthopedic doctor like uh, heart doctor uh, heart related doctors and uh, uh, brain related doctors so these are the depends on the uh, category and uh, facility uh, according to the um, uh, or you can say cascading according to the category so date is there uh, feature according to the calendar and you can choose the next day after to uh, after today okay so after uh, you choose the date and you will see that uh, the time slot between the uh, between the dates so you can choose any uh, time slot like 10 to 30 and uh, click to book now button if you want to click okay okay now after that you booking history is there uh, by my booking you can say that booking appointment and there that is the detail um, of the user id name address and mobile email id uh, etc user id is there disease is there uh, treatment is there and denote is there and date time is there okay so if you want to cancel the uh, booking so we have a text box and uh, you when we click on the delete button you will see that uh, uh, that type of uh, pop-up will show want to cancel appointment click ok button ok after that you you have to search uh, doctor by their name um, ok uh, and by their uh, um, you can say that proficiency so after that you have to click on the submit button and you will see that uh, a table like uh, doctor id named address mobile number and category of the doctor ok that is the feedback options now uh, after that you have uh, seen that uh, that features will be available in the patient login okay so uh, that feature uh, user id and password on the for that um, patient doctor login it here doctor will see that uh, my appointment view customers add description my detail and logout features and uh, customer details is there user id name address mobile number email sex edge uh, whatever okay and the patient treatment history uh, like that user id disease treatment uh, denote and uh, date time is there okay so uh, and the add treatment is also there according to the user id user id name treatment for treatment and the notes submitted to the um, particular customer particular patient so view my detail is also there doctor id name address mobile and category and the customer detail is also there user id name address uh, to see by the doctor and uh, that feature is actually available for the admin okay add doctor facilities also um, view by the admin doctor details is there view appointment is there user id doctor name appointment date appointment time and that mm, delete options is also there for the admin view feedback thank you very much for watching